Hi, this is Dawn Richardson for Walking in the Way, out uh, taking the dogs for walks. So I got the dog leashes here. I hope you're doing fabulous today. And I just wanted to share briefly about an experience I had yesterday in Dublin. And I'll be exploring further through a Soul Streams experience of one kind or the other. So I uh, wanted to ask you if you ever look at something that a situation perhaps in your life and you know it's uh, familiar and so you see it uh, in a certain light and you have already drawn some conclusions perhaps without even knowing about uh, what has un unfolded to date and uh, um, you know the motivations of another uh, individual perhaps or just uh, the very um, the very feeling of the experience or the scene or the person or the place or the thing. And sometimes it's possible, don't you think, that we might be able to see things in a different light. And so that is what occurred to me yesterday. That is the main, uh, main uh, thing I've been grappling with after an experience yesterday in Dublin. So just briefly, I went to uh, renew my visa and I had a day in Dublin so I went to a bunch of museums and I went to the National Gallery of Art here which is spectacular. They're actually redoing it right now so some of the collection is not on view uh, and saw a wonderful new um, exhibit and then went to the permanent collection and just as I was about to leave I was taking actually a picture to remind myself of where I left off in the gallery um, the guard said to me the security guard who I'd asked if I if I could take a picture he said um, yeah if you like that painting you really should go around the corner and and uh, check out uh, the Caravaggio and I was surprised that they had a painting by him so I did go around the corner and what I saw was a painting I actually didn't know about and it stopped me in my tracks. It was a painting called The Taking of the Christ, or The Taking of Christ, and it was the scene in the Garden of Gethsemane um, early in the morning before daybreak when Judas comes into the garden and betrays Jesus with a kiss. And of course this is a scene, uh, having a Christian background, that I am very familiar with. And it's one that I have contemplated previously. But this painting just seized me. It grabbed me. And I think it was the way that the painter uses uh, a context that is quite dark. Uh, and then an interesting treatment of light. And the contrast and the play of light within this dark scene is it draws you in. <clears throat> so I'm going to explore this further and share my uh, experience with you. Sometimes I feel I am led to circumstances and places and uh, events and people that are really, uh, I don't quite know what to make of them sometimes. They often make sense uh, in retrospect. For, so check with me a couple years from now and I'll, I'll know more about this one. But what I have been um, just more and more led to do is to share some of these experiences with you. And uh, so I put together a little introduction uh, to the types of experiences I'll be sharing. And I will add the link here in the blog so that you can access that and see if it's something that you would benefit from just in terms of having an opportunity to engage with these experiences that, that I'm having in your own unique way. So check it out below and have a fabulous day and consider in your own life uh, the play of light and how you might see familiar scenes in a different light. I'll talk to you next time. Take care.